there is one brand that you guys tag me in on TikTok every single day and it's Opali. I believe this is a UK brand. I've had a little bit of experience with their dresses, not a ton though. So we're gonna dive in and I'm here to deliver with almost every dress that you've tagged me in. If I was gonna do every single one of them, this is gonna have to be multiple parts, <laughs> but I'm excited. Their dresses are really fun. And in my experience, you get pretty good quality for a decent price. And you usually do get what's promised in the pictures and the videos on social media. So let's check some of them out. Here's the first dress that I have gotten tons and tons of tags in. I think it's both because of the dress and just the marketing in this video is very well done, honestly. This comment made me laugh too. You're telling me a ghost has a better body than me. <laughs> For real, that ghost body though. So what does this dress look like in real life on a real person? We're about to find out. It's called the Giselle dress. It was $85 and I got it in the mauve color. Here it is. Okay, I haven't even opened this one and it's already exceeding my expectation. Oh my goodness. Look how pretty these little floral details are. They're like in little crystals. That's so pretty. The trick is figure out how this goes on. I think it just ties around my neck. Okay, be right back. Man, how do people wear stuff like this? I think I need some tape or something. I don't know if I trust this. <laughs> Leo, what do you think of my dress? <laughs> a little side eye. Okay, do I look like the ghost? <laughs> okay, this dress actually fits so well. There we go, don't mind my uh, shape warp. I feel like I should be going to an award ceremony in this and accepting an award. I actually love it though. These little embroidered flowers are so cute. Like for $85, I feel like a million bucks. And so far that has honestly been my experience with Opali. This is not sponsored by the way. I spent all my own money on this but I'm just saying if you have like formal event prom cruise wedding like it's not easy to find dresses this good for under 100 bucks I am impressed like if this comes in white it could legit be a wedding dress this is beautiful okay we're off to a strong start let's keep going okay I get tagged in tons and tons of these ones I feel like old Polly has kind of a signature look and it's like a very fitted style with almost like a corset looking top and then like some fabric that kind of drapes across the very top so I think that a lot of these were sold out, but I found one that I think is even cuter. This one actually does make an appearance in a later TikTok too, but this one is called the Adrian. Adrian? Is that how you say that? It was $78. Okay, oh, yeah, this next one actually has some similarities to the one that I'm wearing right now. They might be part of the same like collection actually. Let's open it. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> See, it has some of the same like crystal flowers on it, but it's gonna be a totally different dress. I'm excited for you to see this one. Hopefully it's easier to stand up in than this one is. Be right back. Okay, it's on. Although I'm not entirely sure what these little stringies are supposed to do in the back. I would imagine they tie so that these sleeves don't slide off my shoulders like they're kind of doing, but I can't tie it by myself. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna have to hold these strings. I feel like you can kind of get the gist of this dress though. It's cute. It's really short. <laughs> you gotta really get it tied right. But I like the look of this. I wasn't sure how I'd feel about the detached sleeves, but I think they're really cute. And I love the top of this. Like this meshy corset detail and then this little fabric that goes over the top here. It's really cute. Realistically, I don't really see myself wearing this one. It just seems like a liability, you know? I like to be able to move in my clothes without worrying something's gonna ride up or slip off, so. Not my favorite style, but I think it's beautiful. I feel like you could use it as like a Cinderella Halloween costume. It's fun. It's just already falling apart. <laughs> okay, next. These ones really caught my attention. This one like didn't necessarily go viral by any means, but I actually thought it was hilarious that there's three comments on this video and two of the comments are you guys tagging me in it, so. I'm with you though. I see what you're seeing. I saw this like beaded embellished detail and I knew I had to have it. So I decided to go with the beige one. It was $100 and I'm really excited about it. Okay, I feel like this one is gonna be good. I genuinely can't believe this dress was only $100 for like the amount amount of beading detail on this thing. I'm pretty excited about it. Oh my goodness. <gasps> 
It's so heavy and it's so pretty. Look at that beading. I am like beyond impressed right now. <laughs> All right, let's try this on. Okay, unfortunately, well, not unfortunately, I was probably gonna keep this dress anyway. To get the full effect, I have to take this little guy off. They really love these things that keep you from wearing it and then returning it. I mean, I don't blame them, but let's chop it off. The dress is mine. <laughs> I am trying to figure out still what's going on at the top here. Cause I just like put the strap around the back like that. But I feel like in the TikTok video, it was going like on the front of her neck, at least on one of them. Let's see here. Okay, the white is a totally different dress, I think. What? <laughs> okay, I have the neck thing on totally backwards. Uh, give me a second. Okay, I think I got it. It's a little bit choky, but <gasps> wait, pretty. Oh my goodness, I really like this one. I wasn't sure how I would feel about the color, if it would be like too close to my skin and kind of weird, but <gasps> I love it. It's giving like the same vibe as the Marilyn Monroe dress, you know, the one that Kim wore. Ooh, wait, is this the new favorite? Let me know if you like this one better or the ghost pink one better. <laughs> these are beautiful though. This one has like a super low back. Pretend like I'm not wearing these again. <laughs> and then a pretty high slit on the side. Listen, I wouldn't wear this normally. This is in case we have any slip ups, you know. <laughs> I don't need the whole internet to see something they weren't supposed to see. Yeah, but you get the idea. <laughs> it's also kind of like 2002 prom vibes. I love it. I really do feel like I need to go on a cruise or something in these dresses though. Okay, this one I got tagged in a lot. I'm not entirely sure why. It might be because of the style and the color of the dress. It also might be because of the fabric. Apparently this Model fabric that they use is like a big deal. They're kind of known for it. So I've never tried it. We're gonna try it today though. In the Marley dress, this was $54. And in the description, it even says premium Model fabric that you know and love. So apparently this fabric is a known thing. All right, time to see if this fabric lives up to the hype. Okay, this is exactly what I was thinking. It would be, it almost has like a t-shirt feel to it. It's like a fancy t-shirt dress. Wait, I might love this. <laughs> this could be a really cute, just like casual dress. All right, let's try it. It looks kind of shapeless off of me, but it could, could be good. Let's see. Cute design. So it has this like underneath tight layer and then the kind of flowy over layer. Gosh, I really need to invest in some shorter shorts. <laughs> I don't know, is it too short? Like if I wasn't wearing shorts, we would have a little bit of a, a wardrobe malfunction happen in there. <laughs> Dang it, I love it though. Love the shape of it. It feels really nice. I love a flared sleeve like this and it has the cute little tie detail. The color's beautiful. I knew when I saw this TikTok that it would be really, really short and unfortunately it might be a little, a little too short for me. That's a bummer. Oh, I like everything else about it besides the length. Well, this was for you. You tagged me in it. Here it is in real life. <laughs> Cause they just had it in a mannequin on the TikTok, and I feel like it is helpful to see it on like a real living, breathing human being. <laughs> I'm also 5'8 with um, a pretty long torso. So if you're a shorter person, I feel like this dress could be so cute, but it's just not meant for me. Okay, I also got tagged in this one quite a bit. Once again, I'm not sure if it's because of the dress or because as they're saying in this TikTok, they have new expanded cup sizes, which is exciting because uh, you girl does tend to spill out of things. So we love to see it. Okay, so I am gonna get this long sleeved maxi red dress. I think it's gonna be beautiful. It's $75 and let's see how it is. Okay, I'm excited about this one. I have been having such a fun time on my main channel, like really dressing up for the live streams like I did on the last one. I think I'm gonna make that the tradition. And this could be a good live stream gown <laughs> because unfortunately I have zero other reason to really dress up other than to hang out with you. <laughs> so <laughs> that's probably what these will be used for. Okay, here we go. Oh my gosh, I love this color. <gasps> Except I love red, but I do feel like it clashes with my pink hair tiny bit. That's like the one color that I don't love with my hair currently, but the pink might not stay forever, if you know what I mean. <laughs> it's been over a year, like, what do you think? Is it time for a change? It might be, but we're gonna try this on. I'm super excited about it. It has like a nice structured underwire top. What else do we have? And then one sleeve, one off the shoulder sleeve. Ooh, I'm excited. Okay, so here it is. Um, I did accidentally order the wrong cup size. <laughs> this is supposed to be good for like up to a C. I should have got the next one. So um, that was like, the whole point of this, I'm sorry. <laughs> it's a really cute dress. <gasps> 
Wait, wow. I think this one might actually be the favorite. I kinda need this one in more colors. This is beautiful. It's like a little bit super villain vibes. Okay, this is pretty. This is like walk into a party show stopping dress. <laughs> Got a little slit in the back. I like this though, even though it's like not the perfect size for me, it still looks and feels really good. Ton the strap isn't here, but <laughs> you don't even like need to wear anything under it necessarily. Like the support is pretty good. I'm impressed. Oh, Polly, I am impressed. So if you ever need a fancy formal dress for any situation, oh, Polly has the Hope Scope stamp of approval. <laughs> Let me know what your favorite dress is. I would have to say this one or maybe the mauve one. Yeah. Make sure to check out my Ekin Sue and Opali collaboration video if you haven't seen that one yet, or my Good American review. Enjoy the next video. Say bye, YouTube.